Hey guys, welcome to my video vlog. It's Sunday. Let's break it down of what happened this week. And since I've been, well, it's been two weeks since I've done another one, but I did a small one last week, but you all know. But, Daytona. Let's begin with the Xfinity series. Call it what you will. I understand the yellow line rule, but some said his car, his full car wasn't below the yellow line. Well, which I hear on some people, but okay, here's the thing. Any part on the car, if it's your tire or anywhere, if it's on that yellow line, advancing your position, you're going to be black flagged. That rule has been there ever since 2001. And some do not get it. Now I know sometimes it is a little BS, but it's just the way it is. I mean, it prevents safety, so to say. I can understand that. It plus in the corners because the 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 straightaway and the corners are totally different when it comes to the yellow line. So the corner point, yes. But the straightaway it, it just depends how low they they run them down there. And yeah, I can see for safety reasons why they enforce that. So, but if, but if you're not forced down there, that's a different story, but a, a young kid was trying to go for his first win in, in the Xfinity series, it just, you just can't go below the L line to advance your position. He had plenty of room, actually, to uh, try to make the, um, the, the pass, though, because he had a run in, plus he had plenty of room to squeeze uh, up, up in there, up, well, above the L line, but... Any part of the car touches the yellow line and depends on your position, you're going to be penalized. I mean, kind of like football. Any player's going to touch that white line, they're out of bounds. So, it's the way it was. And some people say it was controversial. I didn't think it was controversial. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't see anything wrong with that. I just seen he, uh, he, uh, he advanced his position. Go, go, go blow the yellow line. That's the rule. If you like it or not, go watch football. <laughs> so, so anyhow, on on to the uh, Cup Series. Um, yeah, speaking of first-time winners, which happened almost last night, but Eric Jones got the W, and this time he didn't advance his position below the other line. <laughs> okay, I'll drop that now. But yeah, but he got a big push from uh, Busher and that. Uh, he gave him his first win. I would like to see Casey Kane won it, but eh, it's okay. I mean, he's, I mean, he was the, the favorite up there. I mean, if, well, if Jones didn't uh, go on the outside, he probably would have pushed Kane to lead, but hey, every driver for themselves when it comes to the final lap, but there's no teammates, there's no um, um, allies. You mean, you're driving for yourself. You're, you're in that race car, and you're there to win not to let somebody else win. So, that's what happened. So, I mean, first time winner for Jones, he's, I mean, he got his first win out of the way, I mean, so good for him. I mean, nothing wrong with that, just another NASCAR Cup Series driver getting his first W. It has happened at Daytona, which has, had, has happened at Daytona in recent years. I mean, the one I remember was David Reagan when he won in the, in the, uh, to, to turn for Roush guy's first win so but, but yeah that's how it happened and plus there's a lot of wrecks too especially there's a lot in stage two which i think they got a little too aggressive i i can see towards the end of the race but in the middle of the race so and plus the two of them stenhouse was kind of involved in it now the first one was blocking um um Byron blocked uh, Keselowski, which caused a jam up, and then uh, Brad wasn't straight, and, and then uh, Ricky got into him. Okay, so I can see that a, a checkup type of deal. But the second one he caused, I don't know. Even though, I, which I'm not a fan of Kyle Busch myself, but um, but it just seems that he came up to uh, 
I mean, he was trying to side draft off, off his corner panel? Really? <laughs> uh, no. Uh, I think he intentionally, yeah, did some little aggressive racing on that part. Call it what you will, but just the way it is. I mean, it seems like Ricky's becoming an aggressive driver on all those play tracks. <laughs> it just seems that way nowadays. But, hey, I mean, I, I mean, aggressive is aggressive driving. I mean, do what you can to win. So, that's the way it was. But, but I mean, but he didn't win. I mean, he got in two accidents, which was not of his own doing, but, I mean, but, I mean, it came back to abide him, though. By his, by, by his aggressive driving through the night. So, happens. I mean, if you get aggressive, you're going to pay the price. And it did, didn't last night. So, so I have on that. Now, NHRA. Epping. And Pro Stock, um, Chris McGahey won over a redlining Erica Enders, which, which that was her second one of her career, actually. Normally doesn't happen. But uh, anyway, she takes the points lead in the Pro Stock. Um, and, and a funny car, um, Matt Hagen beat Tim Wilkerson, which Tim Wilkerson has been in the final a long time. And then it was Torrance, uh, Steve Torrance beating Antron Brown. So, so that how, how it came to. In fact, uh, Don Schumacher's top top field cars were all. I mean, three of them were in the semifinal, and they managed to, yeah. <laughs> so, but that happens when we have a team. I mean, I mean you have so many cars, and then, then uh, I mean there will only be two, and then one winner. So, but. That's how a team works in motorsports. Just depends how, but yeah. So that's how what happened there. Epping next, and then to take a week off. Then it's the Western Swing. Going to begin at Denver, then down to Sonoma, then up to Seattle. It's going to be fun. One of my favorite times of the year when the NHRA travels west. It's going to be nice and awesome. And now. WWE. Well, Kevin Owens had quite a ride, ride in a porta potty, huh? <laughs> so, I just like the wolves that blue stuff all over him. I, it's like, okay, there's probably the cleaning stuff in the porta potties, but he was dosed with it. It's like, <laughs> I expected brown stuff maybe, but yeah, maybe it was a clean porta potty. Who knows? <laughs> um, and also, um, to, uh, oh, and also Finn and, uh, and Corbin and Arvin go at it at Extreme Rules. That match was made through this week. And um, then Lashley and Reigns are going to go at it. Um, then there's um, who else? Oh, and plus Bailey and Sasha having that conversation with Dr. Shelby, who was um, a, a doctor for Daniel Bryan and Kane. So he made his return, and speaking of Dan Bryan and Kane, uh, they got a take title match with Team uh, the Bludgeon Brothers. But okay, here's my thing with the uh, Team Hell Hell No returning. All right. So 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 the original team name was Team Hell No, but why are they saying yes? Could could just call them Team Hell Yes? <laughs> But, which I understand they're tricky the classic name, but it doesn't make sense anymore. That's the writers for you. <laughs> That's WWE writers. Or Kevin Dunn. Whoever you want to blame. Um, let's see what else going on. Uh, well, um, NXT, uh, Johnny Gargano beat um, EC3, and I guess they're going to have him and Champa are going to have a maybe another match. Maybe. Depends on the Longest Robert goes in, and then uh, when they go to the main roster, um, and also to um, think. Oh yeah, and then plus there's uh, a title match next week, a uh, rematch clause. The uh, the undisputed but face the good face of Mustache Mountain for the NXT Tag Titles, and plus in three weeks they're gonna there's gonna be a next NXT title match between um, Alistair Black and Tommaso Ciampa, which I'm a which I got a feeling that, that Johnny Gargano is going to probably interfere in that match. I, I got a good feeling of that. Because that robbery's not over. It's long, it's a long way from being over. So, so yeah. So, they have it on that. 
Now, uh, haven't heard anything in the NFL. It's been really quiet. Uh, NBA, there's some of these going on right now. Uh, Portland, Portland, I think, just play here. Let me take a look. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're playing Atlanta. Yeah, they beat uh, Utah in their first game. So, yeah, it's their summer league. Even though that the, this game just doesn't count, but it does hurt to, to check. I mean, well, for their uh, summer league team, pretty much it's their bench that's playing, so. Oh, good. They won. 85-68. Nice, so. So they're 2-0 right now, so which is good for Portland's Summer League team. Need that momentum heading to the to begin the season for Portland. Needs to happen. I'm sitting. And now MLB standings here. I heard that Seattle was kind of on a hot streak too. In the manners. And I think they won t today. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what. Okay. So Boston's in the lead still in the in the um, East American League. And also, by the way, Seattle did win their game against Colorado today, while the Yankees won in final ten innings. I think it was against uh, who was it? Who was it? Oh, I forgot. Um, dang, I forgot. Oh, it was Toronto. That's right. Okay, so anybody out there about three games behind Boston? Um, in the Central, it's it's Cleveland. About ten games ahead of Minnesota in the West, it's Houston with Seattle about four back. In the National League East, it's the Phillies. Oh, it's tight between them and the Braves. In the Central, it is Milwaukee, and, and they got a three-game lead over Chicago. In the West, it's Arizona, and they got a two-game lead over the Dodgers. So, let's see which team's doing hot, and which one's not here. Got two of them, six in a row, and they're both in the uh, American League East, Boston and Houston. So, and see which team is doing not so hot. I see one. Wait, I see one has the most. Yep, it is the Royals. Nine straight losses. Oh, that's got to hurt. <laughs> Ugh, yeah, and plus they're like, Oh boy, they are way back from the central lead, like about over twenty games. So, <laughs> so if the so if the Royals won't get in the playoffs, they got to do is they got to do a lot of work. So, and plus all star games coming up here too, not too soon. So, we'll see how it goes. Um, have heard anything in college sports lately? Oh, actually, I do. Um, which I forgot to mention this uh, last week um, when the Beavers won the College World Series, but um, Oregon they they did some recruiting and they got and they had a player who picked between three three teams a, a five star wide receiver who committed to Oregon I think about a couple weeks ago. So and guess what was one of those teams that he chose over Florida State. <laughs> Which I think I did mention the next week. I didn't. Oh, yeah, I did mention it last week. Brain fade. <laughs> but yeah, but put you all know about it. But still, I mean, I mean, it's a great pickup. I think Oregon picked up a couple other players too. I think one was a four-star lineman, and the other was a three-star lineman. So, but yeah, but sorry, I totally forgot about it. <laughs> it happens. Brain fades. It happens. So don't quite remember. So anywho, nothing else in college sports. So it, as as of that. So. My uh, playlist update, I got some new likes on there, so go check them out. I, I also added, I believe here, let me check it out here. I believe I added more wrestling themes, I believe. Yes, I have. I got updates on my wrestling themes and my non beauty themes as well. So those are the latest three updates on my playlist, so go check them out. Please do. 
And now, two weeks, there's going to be a lot of comments, so it's time to read your comments, sponsored by Budamania 1989's channel. Go check them out. I got the, the right spot here. Okay, oh wait, got to keep going down. Oops, it just, <laughs> once I t turn my phone back on and then it, um, then it went back to the top one. Okay, here we go. So hopefully this won't be much, but but you, Buttermania, we'll see. <laughs> nothing wrong with it, like, like I said, all, all the time. There's nothing wrong with it. All right, so anyway, uh, this guy did a double comment, um, and I responded to him, but I'll read off anyways. Uh, oh, my, uh, two weeks ago, my uh, full video vlog, my last one, a mega garlic commented, how come you don't have W2K18 and what's your job? Well, apparently he has been following my channel. <laughs> but I do have it for you, for those of you who don't know. I do have W2K18 and my current job right now is being a curtsy clerk at Safeway. So, yeah. Which is not an easy job, by the way. So, got to make groceries, got to buy fish carts, got to attend the ballroom. Got to do a lot of other like go backs and all that stuff and just I mean just like um, like yesterday I did go backs from a from a uh, from a full from a full cart and that took me about five hours to to get done with well, with other things in my way like cards bagging all that stuff so you know and I mean it's not an easy job to get to get things done around that place trust me I've been there for years <laughs> so. Which is good pay, but just the time's coming. Just gotta wait till Jason Crow gets his uh, business all, all gathered up and not too soon. I'm gonna have a job change. Yeah, it's gonna happen because I'm gonna live that place in a heartbeat. <laughs> and just like you worked there for so many years, and it's like, not enough, you know. I mean, just. I mean, you're getting tired of it, and plus, new, new stuff, new craps coming up that you have to deal with, and I'm just like, you know. <laughs> but that's our world. That's our career, our jobs. I mean, problems are going to happen. I mean, no jobs can be perfect, you know. So that's the way it is. That's the way life is. All right. So okay, Bud Demanian, I came down and commented on my uh, Legends of Wrestling. Sh me show down Legends of Wrestling. I, I think this was on the 80s. I think. Let me see. Classic. Okay. Showdown Challenge mode. Okay, part two. This was the 80s. 80s champion. Congrats. Thanks. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. I think this is part three. 90s champion. Congrats. Proud to hold the title. <laughs> And okay, and then and, and, and then same guy on, on my TNA Impact PS2. Angle, you fool. <laughs> okay, and same same guy on my uh, uh, TNA Storm mode, I believe. Look. Yes. This is part one. Lax, you 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 will pay for what you did, and they did. Okay, and the same guy, same game, different part. Good, good job teaming up with Young, no problem. Okay, and then Jin Shura, Cree Hargrove commented on my live stream on my W2K18 career mode part 34. Who's your favorite WWE superstar? I got three of them. Current, is current. Okay, well not current, but. Anyway, my current ones is Shinsuke, Rude, and Balor. Uh, my greatest one of all time, my channel name, Brett Hitman Hart, which my channel is Hitman Reinhardt. So you see where I got the Hitman from. So yeah, he's my favorite. Okay, then here we go. Okay, back to Funimania on my Teenage Impact Story Mode. This is part three. Lax, 
we got the, the women and and the belts. Awesome job. <laughs> okay, same guys, same game, different part. Japan, it's time to, to make our mark here. Indeed. And we did. Okay, same guys, same game, different part. Styles, no matter in the USA or Japan, we will destroy you. Indeed. And we did. And same guy, same game, different part. Good uh, good matchup with, with Booger T. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Good uh, good matchup with with Nash. No problem. Okay, and then same guy on my WW no, no WWE, my WCW versus NWO World Tour League Challenge Part One. Nice job with Eddie. No problem. And same guy, same game, different part. Awesome job with Ray. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Nice job with the Steiner brothers. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Good job with the horsemen. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Different part. Nice job. Nice job with the outsiders. No problem. Okay, then Iceman commented on my NASCAR weight earn your stripes final part. PS2. Wonder, wonder if he'll do a NASCAR 09 series. Yes, I will. Which will be coming right after Raw 2. Then E93 Sports commented on my showdown legends of, of, of wrestling. So, okay. He said, "Okay." He commented, "Is is is there a part two? There is. Search for it. <laughs> it's on my channel." Okay, and then back to Budmania 1999 on my WCW versus NWO World Tour Challenge League. Nice job with with Fuji. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Nice job with six. No, no problem. Which is X Pac or She Waltman. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Nice job with DDP. No problem. Okay, then same guy on my WWE Raw two season part two. Good, a good matchup with with Orton and Flair. No problem. Okay, then same guy on my WWE first NWO World, World Tour uh, League Challenge. On the parts, nice nice job with Luger. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, game different part. Nice job with Savage. No problem. And then, and same guy on my WCW NWO Re Revenge. I believe this was a champion. Let's see. Yeah, championship mode. Nice, nice job with Jericho. No problem. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Nice, nice job with DDP. Bang. Same guy, same game, different part. Nice, nice, nice job with Piper. No problem. Okay, then he come in on my uh, WWE2K617 live, live stream, part 35. Joe, you can't stop Hitman, fool. Indeed, you can't stop me. Okay, same guy. I'm on back of my WCW uh, NWO Revenge Part Championship Mode Part Four. Can congrats on the tag titles. No problem. Then Sh Shady Posts Society commented on my. NCAA football 2003. Do do a shot every time he says and at plus go go dogs bow down. Go ducks. <laughs> We're gonna pound you guys this year. Guarantee it. Revenge is, is, is on our mind. Got that robbery, you know. <laughs> then. Supreme got a comment on my W W two K sixteen PS three 
You're the, the best YouTuber. Thank you very much. Then, then, uh, then, then the nice man commented on my uh, NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup intros. 210, terrible censorship. Yeah, that, that was on Dell Jr.'s day 2500 win in, in 04. Yeah, I see the, the yeah, Bud logos on the, on the crew. Yeah, I, could, yeah, I saw that too. <laughs> but they did what they can do. Okay, then, then George L. Crack commented on, on my uh, 4th of July uh, Pounds of Fireworks. Finally, you direct a live video on on a good hour in Spain, and and I missed it. Ha ha ha! <laughs> just the way it is. It's just the way it is around the world. How time evolves. So it's hey, hey it's all cool. It's all cool. Okay, and back to Budamania. I chain I commented on my WWE. On my WWE 2008 vs. Raw 2008 PS3 season mode, part seven. The the there you go, King. Nice job. Okay, same guy, same game, game room part. Edge, how, 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 how dare you take Tori like that? Yeah, Edge. And same guy, same game, game room part. WWE, and, and, and he's W champ. Nice. Okay, and then back to Iceman, who commented on my NASCAR 09 PS2, I think it was part 2, yeah. 827 was, was, was uh, that crew a member of... Stewart's or Denny Hamlin. Okay, let me take a look here. Okay, I see. Got it. Okay, the the crew there. Nah, it just depends what type of color they they are. But Tony's Home Depot, you know, orange and black. Same with Hamlin. Yeah, I can see, but more, I mean, more black on Hamlin. I don't know. I don't really <laughs> pay, pay pay attention much to that. Anyway, same same guy on um, uh, comment on my NASCAR 09 Part One. R.I.P. Rest in peace, Shane Sieg. Okay, he must have passed away. I didn't know about it. Okay, back to Budamania on my WWE Spin Out vs. Raw uh, 2008 PS3 season mode on the parts. ECW, you'll learn n not to mess with him, man. Indeed. And then, Su and then Supreme 3X commented on my WWE Spin Out vs. Raw 2008 PS3. Did you get the docs? What docs? I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, then back to Budamania on my latest W2K17 career mode live stream. Good, a uh, good matchup with Kalisto. No problem. Yes, yeah, sorry guys on my internet. Uh, well, well, the the uh, screen went black on that. I didn't realize it until I watched it. So sorry about that, guys. Blame Charter, not me. <laughs> Okay, then, same guy, back on my W Spin Out vs. Raw 2008 PS3 season mode, one of the parts. Hey man, beats two kings, nice job. Okay, same guy, same game, different part. Hey man takes the, the uh, dead man to hell, indeed. Okay, then 7 a.m., 7 a.m., Moody, come in. On my reaction of the 2018 Coke Zero 400 finish, good, thank you. Then same guy coming in my Raw Two season part three. Are you playing the game in PS One or what? Xbox. That that they made it be Raw Two Four. <laughs> Get your game history right. Your WWE game history. Okay, then back to Budamania on the same game. Mark Henry, you're 
your pin madness didn't work. No, we didn't. And I can't remember how many times he tried to pin me. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, then my my brother, I see Reinhardt three five eight one commented on my reaction to the 2018 Cup Zero 400. Uh, yeah, finish. 205 and 211. Yeah, he was in the picture. That's why he's just pointing that out. <laughs> so, there you have it on that, guys. All comments. Wasn't that much, but yeah, you know. So, anywho, on my WWE Mobile Games update, I didn't get nobody new from uh, WWE Champions, Tapmania, nor uh, WWE Super, Super Card. They're about all the same, I believe. Let me think here. Actually, um, well, I got one that's um, well for my uh, for the Women's World Rumble was um, Beast Hall of Fame uh, Wendy Richter. That's the new one I got. I believe I don't know if I updated anybody else. Nope. Okay, no, not, not nobody I can think of. But yeah, that's so far the newest update one I got. The rest of them are the same. So plus I plus I'm keeping some of my monster cards on there to get a gold star so I can boost them up too. So. So, so it's all good. But, but there's one mode I hate on there that I don't play much, and that's the Elimination Chamber mode on that. It just, I don't like it. <laughs> I, most of the times I kind of lose at that, so I just kind of like, I don't play it much anymore. So and, Until I build my, my cards up, that's what I need to do. So, so anyway, um, nothing else. But as far as videos coming next, I already told you my lineup. Um, about a couple, a couple of weeks ago from my Friday and, and the Saturday videos, so, well, Friday or Saturday, one each, but yeah, Raw 2, Part 4 will be coming either Friday or Saturday, yeah, sorry, it was late last week, um, yeah, Friday, I was at work, and plus I had to do the, no, yeah, Friday, yeah, I was at work on Friday, yeah, I was, yeah, I was at work on Friday, I had totally f forgot to, uh, no, wait, no, 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 I wasn't right work on Friday. Sorry. Sorry. Brain fade. <laughs> I mean, trying to think. I've been working too much. But, um, yeah, um, but yeah, f yeah, Friday, I was at Ken Awake, and um, all, all day, I mean, it was an unex unexpected unex trip. So, yeah, that's, I mean, that just came out of nowhere, which I was going to do a live stream that day, and then, uh, then that came up, and that did late at 7 a.m., I mean, 7.30 p.m., so, yeah. So, and plus, um, and also, too, on Saturday, I, I uploaded on Saturday night because I had to work. So, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I said it was going to come that, that day, too, but, yeah, it's, something's getting in the way, but, yeah, I should have uploaded it after I came back from getting away. I just didn't think about it, but, yeah. But definitely for sure Friday or Saturday th this week. So, plus my college football as well. Coming up, uh, uh, 13, so yeah. So that's pretty much it. And plus, well, what was that, Ken Awake? Um, I got this game. We'll be playing uh, on on Sunday at Jason Crow's place. So, yes, what do you mean? It's an adult party game for me lovers. So this is going to be fun. <laughs> and, and also, about, plus my... Further got a Crabs Against Humanity Volume Four and Five, so that's gonna be fun too. So, and which by the way, I will live stream that just to let you know. And plus, uh, and also too, speaking of live streaming, um, I'm thinking I'm gonna do um, live stream on the WWE uh, pay per views now because, um, which I like doing video, but sometimes they they take too long to process and to put together. So that's why I'm gonna do live streams now. So it just seems to be, be better, which I was thinking about it the other day. It's like, you know, yeah. I mean, it, uh, I mean, a lot of camera space will be taken up my phone. And we'll post on the camera here. I have to worry about the battery and all that stuff. It's like, yeah, heck with it. I'm just going to live stream off my phone for, for, for now on. So so thank you. So, yeah, so, so that's going to work. So, guys, tune in for the Extreme Rules this Sunday. We'll be live streaming both games we're playing. So, yeah. So I'll be busy live streaming. So, actually... Actually, go to my channel after you're done watching Extreme Rules, so we can so we can live stream and, and, and play these two games and see how uh, cringy it will get, dark it will get, or uh, or just a good day, sir. <laughs> how many times people are gonna leave? 
I'm expecting some are gonna probably break, or 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 uh, one be be broken, so to say. But but, but you know what I mean on that. So that's it. Uh, Pendleton, we've been getting warm lately. It's in the 90s, so it's gonna hit the triple digits here not too soon. I'm prepared for it, so it's gonna be fun. Oh yeah, <laughs> summer. We all saw, saw coming, so. So, yeah. So, that's it, guys. So, from the guy who has over 4,000 subscribers, who lives in Pelton, Oregon, I'm signing out. Take care, guys. Oh, and also, guys, I forgot to tell you my live stream update from my W2K16. I just remembered after I ended the video. <laughs> Anywho, but um, on Thursday and Saturday, I'll be doing my 2K live stream, W2K16 career mode live stream so Thursday and and Saturday I'll be doing it so to let you know know on that I totally forgot sorry about that guys but but now I'm officially signing out take care guys